Hi guys, uh, I'm going to teach you in this clip uh, how to make a homemade incubator. It's very easy and if you just follow this uh, procedure that I'm uh, going to explain, it would be uh, successful. Uh, you don't need to buy really expensive ones uh, that you go in the market. Uh, basically, the main thing is uh, that uh, you need a cooler like this, that as you can see from here. Uh, where I got it from is, uh, I went to a medical store they basically get the medicine in a cooler like this delivered so I, re I requested that uh, requested it to them so that they could give it to me so they did so what I done was I've uh, cut the top bit off and uh, a picture glass frame um, I've took the glass off and uh, taped it on top so that it becomes a good window and uh, there's a main thing that you need is it's this it's a temperature gauge which shows you the humidity at the bottom and the temperature on top this is it so what you got to do is just put this inside the box so you know what humidity and the temperature is going on and inside if you look at the box it's a 9 watt energy saver which I've uh, put there and uh, there's a this is to prevent <coughs> the chicks uh, to go uh, near to the bulb so we can stop them you can see one chick uh, went right there and uh, but it couldn't go further so I had to come back and uh, there is a a CPU fan laptop fan which I've just taped here and from outside what I do is I just uh, stick a battery tape it together here so it just turns on and the hot air um, circles around in the box and this is just a piece of clock basically so what it is um, when the bulb is on you continuously uh, put it on and uh, there is a required heat the temperature when it uh, reach its required level like you need 102 Fahrenheit so what you got to do is you need to make holes around the box so that the temperature stays there and doesn't increase and neither decrease so these holes around the box keeps the temperature constant so once the, once the temperature is constant leave it leave it overnight once you left it overnight and you see you have seen that the temperature is constant and it's not going up or down coming down so you can just put your eggs in there and leave it for 21 days and what you have to do is just turn them three times a day morning daytime and the evening and uh, hopefully the last three days you don't need no turning because the chick needs to uh, make its room to come out from the egg shell so there you go uh, this is a homemade incubator it's very cheap the only thing that you have to buy is this and the rest of it is just a, a piece of cake and surely for humidity what you need to do is you need to uh, leave a uh, little tissue wet tissue in the incubator so that the humidity should uh, reach its required target so I'll explain that through my comments. Um, any questions, please feel free to comment at the bottom and I would answer. Thank you.